In today's video, I'm going to show you one of my favorite plays for beating man-to-man -man coverage as well as beating cover four drop show two in Madden 21. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch today's YouTube video. Now, if you've never been to my channel before, what I do is I break down every single day Madden 21 tips and tricks. We do offensive tips and defensive tips every single day. And what we're trying to do here at the channel is basically help you get better at Madden 21. We also stream every single night. Now, we upload four tips and tricks every single day. A video goes up at 2 o'clock, 4 o'clock, 6 o'clock, and 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time every single day and then we also stream on our youtube channel every night live and basically answer your questions live right here on youtube so if you're interested in being a part of our community and kind of what we're doing to help each other get better at the game i would highly encourage you to go ahead and click the subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of your screen all right guys so i'm in the arizona air raid offense this has been truly one of my favorite offenses that i've ran uh, throughout the course of this season and I want to talk to you about one of my favorite plays it's one of the plays that I think completes this offense and makes it super super effective and I actually broke this down a little bit earlier um, in the week talking for um, from a perspective about cover zero blitzes and what, what you can do from this to beat it but this is more of a uh, man beater and zone beater kind of combo and it's the H shallow cross H shallow cross from the spread Y flex I like to flip this play um, because I'm normally in the spread wide slot flipped. You don't have to flip it. You just want your best wide receiver to be the receiver that's running the post route. For the Packers, Devontae Adams is the perfect receiver to be able to do this. And obviously, Rodgers has the best arm in the game. And he's the perfect quarterback to be able to get this to him. If you're playing Mutt, that's where you want to have your Deion Sanders, your Randy Moss, you know, whoever you have out there that's really fast and has really good route running. 90 deep route running is really critical um for this play to work so eight shallow cross okay so all we're going to do on this play and we're going to show it to you against two coverages the first coverage i want to show it to you is just like straight up cover two man press um cover two man press against cover two man press and the adjustments for this all we're going to do is we're going to put uh the left side receiver on a comeback route and smart route it and then with the tight end there in the right slot we're going to put him on a slant route that's it that's all we're going to do um, you could take the running back and either block him or you could put him on a um, you could put him on a, a little flat route to the right or you could leave him on his route to the left. It doesn't really matter. What you'll see is against cover two man, you could kind of get that route up to Devontae Adams. And you have other things open too against cover two man. Um, one of the things that I'm going to do though is kind of call off the dogs a little bit because the practice mode sheds are absolutely insane. So we're just going to kind of you know max coverage out here but basically what you'll notice is this route to Devonte adams has a pretty good chance um against man coverage to really just basically it's a pass lead straight up and as you see right there as long i don't know why but since the latest patch it's kind of been interesting how many like throws like that have kind of just i don't know it's not been it's not been very fun i've been missing a lot of like one play touchdowns due to that so I don't know if that's something to do with the latest patch or what. But anyway, slant Lewis, and then you're going to um, you're going to um, post route Adams. And again, it's just a simple pass laid up. Click on, and you see right there, it's an absolute laser against press man. Now, what people's solution to this is going to be is, especially if they're going to run some max coverage, what they're probably going to do is they're going to do something like this right here. So they're going to put a deep inside middle third right there and then you know it's going to be like okay what do you do well you do have some options um, especially if they're doing something like that it's likely that they're going to be running some type of coverage defense so you know you're going to have a little bit more time in the pocket but basically what you'll see here is wait 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 and then throw it all the way across to the right now right there jamel dean actually boxed um Devontae adams which is very very rare if you again if you have that um, the other thing that you have to be aware of is if they do that, they're going to shade coverage outside and over top because they don't want to get burned over the top, right? That's why sometimes I'll leave that, that right side guy on, a, on just that outside streak if they're running a lot of press man. If they're running off man coverage where they're not pressing, that's where the comeback route comes in handy. But anyway, um, you'll see here, Devontae Adams, now that he has a free release, he's not going to be bothered by that. 
and just hard right pass lead. Once he gets even with him, he's leaving, and you have a pretty decent chance to pull that down um, against that coverage. Now, obviously, there's other things that you can hit. If they do that, you know, then you do this. Um, if they're doing something like that consistently, the other thing that you can do is same kind of concept, same kind of principle here. I'm going to put that comeback out there, you know, and then I'm all I'm going to do is motion Devontae Adams to the right, snap him kind of right in here. And you'll see he's going to beat him by about 10 yards over the top. As long as you can catch the ball. I don't know why you can't catch the ball right now. Um, that's kind of a thing. I don't know if other people have been experiencing that, but I've been experiencing a ton lately uh, where, like, your receivers just won't react, like, to the route. And they'll be, like, wide open. And they're, you're throwing, it's not like you're throwing it at the wrong time or anything. But anyways, when you motion him over, it causes, a little, it causes him to get switched onto the middle linebacker. Um, which is a great matchup for him, obviously. But also, think about it. They're going to use the middle linebacker most of the time. So, you know, it's not going to be a great um, – it's not going to be a great matchup for him. So that's cover That's cover two man. Now, um, really quickly, before we go any further, if you would like to get more in-depth videos, more high-level, and more kind of holistic full schemes, I actually have a text message membership that offers that. Every single week, what we do is we release to you a full 45-minute to an hour, uh, basically, scheme, whether it be on defense or offense. So in the past, we've done the big nickel over G. We've done the split close from the Patriots playbook. We've done the gun bunch from the Carolina playbook. We give you a full entire scheme, so we show you everything that you need need to develop a really really good scheme uh, from those formations so if you would like to get access to those videos all you gotta do is text me uh, one text message you get access to them we've got 11 of them in there right now we're about to add a 12th one today so shoot me a text my number is 812-216-3644 also if you just have gener general Madden questions you can also text me as well all right, so now what I want to do is I want to talk about this Cover 4 Drop Show 2. Um, cover 4 Drop Show 2, and this is kind of, you know, to me, if I was running this from 335, this is what I would do with it, you know, but it's it's really, really good coverage. Um, the beauty of this play, you really don't even have to make any adjustments to beat it. What I like to do is put Funches on that comeback route and then put that slant route from Mercedes Lewis. You don't have to do either one of those things. It will still beat it. But the key is that in route right there, you're going to see – the safeties, um, I don't know why that left side safety followed him. I think I threw it maybe just a little bit early. But basically what you're going to do is you're going to wait for your, because um, I've been getting a lot of questions about this. You're going to wait for, whoops, uh, let's go to cover four, show two. Here we go. There we go. Okay. So you're going to wait for your safety, that left side safety. You're going to wait for him to kind of come down, basically. Um, so you're waiting, 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 waiting. And then I'm going to throw it hard to the right. And as you see right there, it's an absolute laser right over the top of the defense for a huge, huge gain. And you can do this consistently. Um, you can do this against different cover threes. For example, if I was in the 335 uh, normal and I was going against of that going up against that cover four drop, this would also be the formula that I followed to basically beat it. This right here. Um, to me is the easiest way to beat cover four drop in Madden. You'll see he's going to get even with him and he's going to get over him. Now this specific one is actually being a little bit wonky with the way that that safety is following him. That normally doesn't happen from this, uh, this coverage. So I don't know if there's some kind of principle because there's, um, because if it plays like it's quarters because they don't have an extra yellow, um, or something like that. But if that's happening, what one thing you can try is just wheeling the running back that sometimes helps this but basically once he's even hard there he goes there that's where he came off right there so you see he comes off of him and then that's where you get your one play touchdown once that left side safety leaves him there's no other safety to get over the top of him so if you're worried about the if you're worried about the safety kind of hanging on him a little bit then you can run you know a wheel route to your running back or something like that that will help it um, also, you know, smart routing everything, uh, I think helps, you know, smart route, your comeback route, smart route, your in route, smart route, your, your post route for sure. You know, those are all things that are going to help this play, but you'll see right here, he's going to run away right there. See how he let us from go. 
And right when he lets him go, there's nobody to come back and get him. And it's an absolute laser. So that's how to beat cover four drop and Madden. I've been getting a lot of questions about that. If you want to get the full Arizona offense, so this is one excerpt. This is one play out of an ebook that has over 100 pages of material with breakdowns on the entire spread offense and cluster and all that stuff. So if you want to get that entire ebook, I would highly encourage you to pick it up. The link is going to be in the description for you. Um, a lot of people have had a lot of success with this in weekend league and regs uh, with the spread offense. So if you want to kind of study the air raid and the spread Arizona Cardinals offense, I think it's one of the best, if not the best offense in Madden 21, just because it has these dominant power routes all over it with post routes and corner routes and all of these special routes, in my opinion, that are going to take your offense to the next level. You can use hot routes to kind of make other stuff work for you, um, but really, really good. The spread is so much better this year than it was last year because of the fact that you can hit the quick flats. You can hit quick reads here and there. Um, so I'd encourage you to check, take a look at it. I think it is truly one of the best offenses in the game right now, um, and it's really, really easy to learn. Um, it's, 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 we've taken people that have never passed the ball before and we've turned them into 500 yards per game passing, uh, with this offense. This offense is always going to work, um, because it's based on sound football concepts in my opinion. And you're going to be able to learn a lot about not just Madden, but you're going to be able to learn a lot about football when you watch and read the book, because we show you mesh posts. We show you real, uh, life principles from the air raid. Why cross? Um, Z shallow. We, we show you all of these different principles. Why corner? Um, and then we also show you how they actually work uh, in Madden NFL 21. So anyway, I just want to thank you for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed it. And we will see you guys in our next one. Now, real quick, I do want to invite you before we take off to our stream tonight. If you have Madden questions or if you just want to hang out with us, maybe play some Madden. We do that every night at 10 o'clock uh, on this YouTube channel. So come back to the channel tonight at 10 o'clock. And if you have any other questions, just text me. Uh, I can always help you guys uh, get better at the game.